Hi everyone, are you seeking to attach a file to the advanced email editor? It is easily done. All you need to do is open up your email. So I'm just going to go into quick actions, send email, then click into the advanced editor. So yes, switch her on over so we can get to those handy dandy tiles and tools and add in images, videos, and what we're going to talk about today is a link to a file. So once this opens up, It'll have like the little default box here that's going to land and then we can start adding content such as dragging our tiles over uh, for different types of events. All right, once the page loads, all we need to do is start dragging content into the field of the email. So we're going to go ahead and drag a button over. Now when we drag this over, we're dragging over a content box and we need to be able to attach something to this content box so it works, so it triggers some type of action. So in this case, we want people to click a button for more info. When we click on this box, and you can kind of see it's a white background, but when we're hovering over it, it's kind of a blued out background. When we click into this, it turns white, meaning we've chosen that to edit this content within this particular content we've added. So you can see these content properties here are all in reference to this box and button. So now I can say, okay, well, I want to drop a link in here. So I'm going to grab my link from my Google Documents. So because, you know, I'm never going to give you up or let you down. And I'm going to show you how to attach this file. So all we need to do is click share here on the top right. And I have this set to anyone with a link can view. And I'm just going to copy that link. Go back to my email. And then I'm going to just drop the link in to the doc and click outside of the box to cement it to the button. So now it's set up so somebody can click this button and this link will be sent. Now the neat thing about this is that I can actually click into the button and write anything I'd like in here. Uh, so then you can just type in and add more information. So Earlier, I sent myself a test of this, and when I sent the test, it basically had the button, and there's a photo that I had dropped in at the time. And when people click the button, it takes them directly to the link of which I dropped into and attached to the button. I hope you all have a great day. Bye-bye.